Good morning everybody, it's me again Crazy Bag Lady, so it's Tuesday morning, so I've been testing out my Avon Cream Blush again, so I've used the Cream Blush and I've used the Avon True Colour Powder over the top of it as well, like the powder blush, I've got my Avon Serum Foundation on again, really like it, some people have said it's very similar to the Charlotte Tilbury one, they do one like an Illuminous one and a lot of people have said it's as good as that, so yeah, it's about £9. Proof is in the pudding. It's really good. Anyway, so, calendar of the day. Ta -da! Today it says, anything is possible. And I think we all have to remember that sometimes. So, I didn't sleep very well last night. I've no idea why. My husband woke me up very early this morning because Dolly had made a mess in her little pen. And we also had a power cut, so it's been quite a stressful morning so far, but the power is now back on. So we have to remember to look after ourselves, anything is possible. So good morning, let's hope we have a lovely Tuesday. So that's today's weather. It doesn't look very nice out there, it's very, very windy. Um, doesn't look that warm and today is the first day that Dolly can go out so probably take her for a little walk around the garden and stuff might take her for a little walk in the street um I just wish that it had been a really nice day then it would have been lovely but yeah so Dolly gets to test the real world today which is really lovely right I've made it downstairs the kettle is on I had to make a drink this morning by boiling some water on the top of the hob Oh dear, I couldn't cope with that my morning cup of tea. So, anyway, kettle is now on. Thank God for electricity. What are you doing? Are you okay? You get to go outside today, don't you? That's very exciting. <laughs> I think that cushion's a bit big for you. She does love her toys so much. She carries that yellow cushion around. That was actually Winnie's. <laughs> but Dolly seems to have cleaned it. I can't believe that she tries to carry that around, can you? It's about the same size as her. Do you like that? Is it nice? There's my breakfast. So my breakfast this morning, I've got two wheat bix chopped banana and skimmed milk. And my cup of tea. So it's now 10 to 10. I'm still waiting for Ruby to get up. Ruby's definitely turned into a teenager. Not up before 10 o'clock. <laughs> right. Let the boring jobs come in. So I'm actually finding it not too bad. Not using my dishwasher. I thought I'd miss it more than I have done. I've been quite surprised really. So I've not used my dishwasher since about Friday. Whether I'll get more fed up with it, I don't know. But so far, I've been all right not, wash, not using my dishwasher. So that's another good little trick. Uh, if you're looking at saving, you know, gas and electric and stuff. So I'm not using my dishwasher. I've even realised that the clock was always on on my cooker and I don't use the clock for the time. Uh, so I've actually switched my cooker off as well. So I'll only need to switch it on when I need to cook with it. So I think it's all the little things that are on standby and all the little things that you leave plugged in that you don't think about, which all add to your bills. So look carefully at your home and see if there's anything that you can switch off that you're not using. So my oven was a big one for me. I never even thought about it. Whereas now I've switched it off. Here I am. I'm so cold. I'm so cold. I'm so pigged off with being cold. Um. So anyway, I've got. A I thought. I wonder what the temperature is in my kitchen because it's bloody freezing here. And I've just sort of googled it and downloaded a free app on my phone that tells you roughly what your temperature is. So I've just done it. Can you guess what the temperature is in my kitchen? Bear in mind, I've got a vest on. I've got a thermal top on. I've got a blouse on. I've got an alpaca wool cardigan on. I've got UGG sheepskin boots on and I thought is it me am I not very well I don't feel 100% today but I think it's because I didn't sleep very well and then my hubby woke me up really early and maybe jumped saying that the dog had pooed in it to run um but anyway so the temperature in my kitchen is 10 degrees it's 10 degrees and it says it feels like 9 degrees so that is why I am so cold because it's 10 degrees in my kitchen 10 degrees that's absolutely freezing that <laughs> your home should be about I don't know, your home should be like probably 18 or 20 degrees to be comfortable, not 10 degrees. I think I need to put my coat on. <laughs> I need to check the temperature in my other rooms now, it's fascinated me. So I think I'm going to move around the different rooms of my house and see what the temperature is. 
right so i've read the reviews on the app and it seems that that app's probably not that accurate so i think the best thing to do to find out the temperature in my house is to buy a thermometer so i'm going to get myself a thermometer so that i can actually see what the temperature is in my kitchen and the rest of my house and then we'll work out why we are so cold <laughs> okay so we're sat on ruby's bed ruby's finally got up <laughs> we weren't watching dolly and she's eating ruby's bed Oh, the jaws of puppies. We were just sat with her talking, but we didn't look what she was actually doing. She was eating your bed. <laughs> so I've ordered a thermometer off eBay, so I'm hoping that that will be good. And for about the last 10 minutes, Florence has decided that there's somebody outside, but there's nobody outside. And she's just like, bark, bark, bark. Have you finished? Hello? Have you finished? <laughs> she's doing there's nobody there and she just keeps barking <laughs> where's Winnie where's Winnie do you know where Winnie is where is she she's there where is she Ta-da! you found her <laughs> did you find her did you find her oh be nice or she'll bite you we've turned into the crazy dog house today as you can hear Florence is still barking I know it is quite windy outside, so whether it's the wind making a bark, I really don't know. But she's just on the mission to bark and bark and bark. So I won't stop barking, Winifred. <laughs> right, test walk. <laughs> it's a test walk. So in a minute, we're just waiting for Ruby to get dressed. Then we're going to take her outside in the back garden. We're going to go for a little walk around the garden. So we're just waiting for Ruby to get her socks on and then we can take her in the back garden. So we've got a harness on ready, haven't we? Yeah, you've decided to get in bed with Winifred while you wait. That's so cute. Oh, so Sarah in your bed with you. Do you want to come in the back garden with the Winifred? Or is it too cold out there? Hey. Oh, Florence. Florence had a mission to bark, 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 isn't she? And I just don't know why. You both look very cute, aren't they? You look so adorable. Oh, <laughs> you're so cute. Right, are we ready? Let's go with our trendy Crocs on. Come on, Lily. Come on, Lily. Shall we lift you over the stairs? Come on. Where's the cat lock? Right, come on then. You've seen Lily before, haven't you? It's Lily. Lily's always outside. Yeah. What do you think to her out here? Hey. Come on, Dolly. Come on. Come on. <laughs> She's more worried about the cat. Come on, look. Try the grass. Come on. Come on, sweetheart. Good girl. There's the grass, look. What do you think? I like the grass. Okay, so they're all out here. <laughs> Everybody's outside in the wind. <laughs> Winifred, we've had this discussion before. You're not allowed to sit on the stairs. Are you listening to me? <laughs> Dolly's gone to sleep. Are you listening? You're not allowed on there. Yes, you are. No, she's not. <laughs> you are not allowed on the stairs, Winifred. <laughs> She's not listening. <gasps> the postman's here. Well, the postman's trolley's here. We're hoping he's bringing us something. I don't really know what, but we're hoping that he's bringing us something. He's gone next door though, so he might not even come here. Ah, the postman didn't come. No mail for us today then. Mind that means no bills either. <laughs> hmm. We're having a moment together. We're actually not running around like <laughs> wallies. We're just sat together. <laughs> when your friend decides that you look like a sofa, so she thought she would just get on. <laughs> oh, I look a better option, do I? Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, so I'm a better option, am I? Just me, Ruby little hand. Uh, I hope you're not eating your harness, Dolly. <laughs> yep, get in. Eat me. It's wine o'clock. It's not wine o'clock. It's coffee o'clock. So 
just making myself a lovely cup of coffee in my oh, I love shopping mum and I've got some dinner so for dinner today I've got mackerel and brine which is free on Weight Watchers little tomatoes which earns you a point back four little seafood sticks and I'm going to have a couple of my little crackers with it um and it's only quarter past 12 so we're gonna have an early dinner and then we're just trying to decide what to do so dolly's had a dinner um so i'm gonna wait and see if she goes to the toilet and then we could perhaps take her out somewhere lipstick of the day so not sure if you can quite see it. i'm trying to get in the daylight so you can see it so lipstick of the day is a matte legend lipstick and the color is blossoming pink so it's a matte finish one it's a really, really nice colour. These Matte Legend lipsticks are so nice. Obviously, I've got the testers of them all. So, the testers are about 50p. And I love the fact that you can test all your different colours. It's so good. Um, so, this one is Blossoming Pink. So, it is a matte one. But I think I'm going to pop um, the Avon plumping stuff over the top. Which then gives it a bit of a sheen. So, let's get the plumper. So, over the top. I'm going to put this and it just gives it this really, really lovely sheen. It's not too sparkly. It just gives it like a nice gloss and it makes your lips tingle. I cannot tell you how wonderful this tingle is. It's not too much. You know, some are really, really tingly, but some you can't feel at all. You can definitely feel this, but it just makes your lips plump a tiny bit. I think it's about six pound, but when it goes on offer, I think it goes on offer for like four pound. Don't think it's on offer at the minute, um, but even at six pound, it's still cheap for what it is. So that's our lipstick of the day. Like that, Dolly? <laughs> oh, my stupid husband has arranged for somebody to come and fetch a car. So at the moment, we can't go anywhere. So I said to Ruby, I think I'm just gonna walk the little dog around the front and the street outside to see what she thinks, little Dolly. Are ready, little dolly? I'm gonna go for a little walk out the front. No, don't eat the gravel. She looks so small. <laughs> Come on then. Come on. Say, Come in. She's trying to eat everything. <laughs> Come on. It's so windy. <laughs> Look at my hair. <laughs> We're back inside. What did you think to that? Did you like it? Bless her. I think you need a pink coat because everyone's going to think you're a boy, aren't they? Unless we can stick some diamonds on it. <laughs> Should we go and put you some diamonds on it? Hey, put some diamonds on your coat. Right, so Dolly's asleep. So we're going to bling her little coat up. So I've got this one. And this one, obviously she really should have a pink one, bless her, but for the time being, we're just going to make these look fancy. Right, so we have a blinged up little jacket. Um, I've not done too much on it, because obviously she'll soon outgrow this. And then me and Ruby have been very busy making something out of, what's it called? Fimo clay. So I've made a thing. Don't really know if it's a mouse or a dog. It looks terrible. <laughs> Let's have a look at your <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to be creative. I'm not sure that mine's that, really that good. It's a bit flat. In fact, I don't even know if it might be stuck to the table. Oh dear. Okay, so I squashed mine because I didn't like it. So I've made Winnie. I've made Winnie. <laughs> Here's my little finger for scale comparison. So it's a little Winnie. <laughs> so I'm not sure if you can see this, but they're in the oven. So you have to bake them in the oven for 30 minutes. Um, not sure how they're going to turn out, but they're in the oven. Ooh, more fanciness. So I've stuck some diamonds on her other little coat as well. <laughs> it's going to be lovely when the sun comes out and the light catches it. Right, our funny little things. 
are out of the oven. So I think they're hard. And then we've got some varnish that you put on them that makes them shiny. Look at Ruth's tiny one. Um, and then we can just keep them forever. So, nice cup of coffee. I've just made Ruby a nice cup of tea. Do you like it, Ruby? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go on then, Ruby. Walk in part three. Woo! <laughs> Back inside again. So, we've put, we've put one of his jump on because she was cold. No! <laughs> it's a frog. It's not Winifred. <laughs> That's a frog in disguise. Was he cold, Winifred? Was he cold? Oh, dear. <laughs> Look nice in your frog jumper. Oh, all that fresh air has worn her out. She's slept a bit more today. I think it's all the excitement of seeing the real world. Bless her. And she's only been outside the front and a little bit out the back. Winifred, you can't be comfy sat like that, my darling. Are you just resting your head? <laughs> oh, the jacket potatoes are in the oven. So I'm doing husband's first because he's got to go back off to work again. I'm trying to have mine slightly later. So... My jacket potato has just gone in. The closer it gets to tea time, the nearer they get to the oven. <laughs> Dolly's not realised this yet, so it's just still just these two. <laughs> and when he was almost dropping his sleeve, it's so cute, like. <laughs> Look at my necklace. Um, it's not sparkling because the sun's not on it, but it once, once the lights are on it or spotlights, it will shine like anything. It fits really nice over my, my shirt. It's really cool. Oh, how cute is that? Oh, it's so cute. Look at the little face. Aww. Right, Robbie's having his tea. I've got to take my neighbour's paper. Let's go. I've got jacket potato with some low fat cheese, some baked beans, some low fat coleslaw and lots of salad. So off to enjoy it. Ah, my tea was lovely. So next job, I need to empty the bin. Are you going to empty the bin for me? <laughs> so they've all just been fed. So everybody's got full tummies. Are you all happy? Is it puppy playtime again? Puppy playtime. Are you nice and warm, you froggy jumper? <laughs> Ooh, so you're all trying to get on my knee now. <laughs> right, my little friend, what did you think to the outside world? Do you like it out there? Hey, or would you rather be in here playing with Winifred? <laughs> hey, do you like the outside world? Oh, it's been a funny old day, hasn't it? It's been a funny old day. <laughs> Off you go then. She's off to play. So it is. I'm going to love you and leave. Going to love you and leave you. So many thanks for joining me again today. I hope you've enjoyed it. It's probably again been a bit. Um, oh, and bird update. So we've been watching our little blue tip bobble come and go in and out the house. They've built a complete nest, but now the little blue tip's not been back for about two days. So my husband's a bit worried. We're not sure if something's happened to it or whether they do this before they actually lay any eggs i really don't know because obviously i'm not a bird expert but uh, he's tried to google it and we're not sure so we don't know if something's happened or whether they're going to come back and lay but the, the little nest is all built and ready but there's just no bird so we really don't know what fingers crossed they come back so anyway my dears if you do enjoy just a bit of real life <laughs> then please subscribe to my channel come and find me on instagram oh the sun's just come out Come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. Come and find these wallies on Instagram as Three Fluffles. Don't forget my little website is down below if you would like a mug of the day. And my little Avon shop is also down below. So obviously I've had the new blusher on again, which you can now see in the daylight. So this is the Avon makeup. I have had this on since about half past seven this morning and it is now about seven o'clock tonight. So as you can see, it really does last the, the test of time. My lipstick has obviously worn off because that one's not a 16 hour one. Um, but the rest of the foundation after then, it's all stayed on. The blush is really lovely, gives you a nice glow. My Avon shop is down below. If you spend 
20 pound you get free uk delivery straight to your door or if not i think delivery is three pounds so i love you leave you <laughs> climbing, climbing all over me so i love you leave you i will see you tomorrow can i believe we've finally got some sunshine it's took till seven o'clock to get some sunshine let's hope we get some tomorrow i'll see you tomorrow bye